news from Saudi and the UAE. Um, apparently, Saudi and the UAE have banned Spider-Man. Um, many Middle Eastern countries, including Saudi Arabia and UAE, have banned Spider-Man across the Spider-Verse, owing to the inclusion of trans flag that appears in the film. Some social media users speculate that the reason for ban is the character of Gwen Stacy being a trans um character I see. Um this is from S to J News I've taken it from and like I mentioned previously in other videos sometimes they don't need to go to a war to get what they want. They get these films and get their ideas across. People watch the films whether they realise or they don't the ideas get into society, they get into the people and people change. And we see things like this and simple things like you they eat differently, they dress differently, they speak differently. These things are common we see people. They adopt the um customs of of the things that they see. For example, you see American movies and then you want to see, then you start speaking we're using terms that are popular in American films. You dress like them, you eat like them, things like this. And this is what they're doing with other ideas like the LGBT idea. So um Banning films like this in a Muslim country is definitely something that should be happening and this is needed and people do say it's just a film. It isn't just a film or just a cartoon or anything like that. From this, people um, have ideas and change and top politicians have said we've used um, films and things like this to change people instead of war, like politicians, I think the current Israeli Prime Minister, I think, or whatever, President or whatever, and others, they've, the high-ranking politicians in the world, like, like, they've said this as well, that we don't need weapons anymore, mostly, we just put things like this, films into, get the kids to watch, change their minds, and we've done our job, so it's, important that Muslim countries do things like this and hopefully other Muslim countries and all Muslim countries that have this film and other similar films don't allow films like this to be in the country or they edit it out the parts that aren't um, aren't um, aligning with Islam.